There's Connor, and he found a crinoid what, Connor? Hold fast. And let's see it. Where did you learn about the crinoid hold fast, Connor? At the beginner's class. Beginner's class on crinoids at Jack Todd. He had all these big photographs up on the screen. And that is a hint to all you new people to come on into the beginner's classes because you'll learn about the uh, fossils, the rare fossils, to keep an eye out for. Something like this would easily go get past uh, a new person. Here's a little sampling of some of the fossils we brought home cleaned up. Um, we have down here we have loose horn coral. And in this slab above there's about uh, four large ones in it. And we have rocks that are just covered with brachiopods, extremely rich in brachiopods. We have rocks that are infilled with crystals in the uh, cephalopod hollows. And uh, we have loose cephalopods as well. Another rock with uh, crystals in the cephalopod hollow. This rock slab is about 15 inches by about 10 inches and it has over a hundred brachiopods in it. Uh, several different species. The whole thing's just filled with brachiopods. Very lovely. Bryozoan too.